we're here on the last day of March 2011 putting on fertilizer for the second day getting ready for planting uh, as you can see no hands we're auto tracking here using GPS to guide the tractor and we're along a ditch bank here I'm opening up the end rows on this field and I'll show you here in a minute you can use this to do other things besides just tracking a straight line. Come up on a curve here in a minute. There's a monitor that runs the GPS. Uh, for what we're doing right now, we got this other box is controlling the fertilizer rate. We'll look behind. Putting on the fertilizer there. You can see I'm pulling right along the track I made going the other way. Space just right. You can look at the monitor here, the white line is where I am going to be going. You can see up there at the top, I don't have to go in a straight line. I can follow a curve. Uh, this will do a lot of other things I'll never use as far as I know. Uh, I can go in circles or right angles. I'm not sure what that's for, but I'll bet there's a use for it. But it comes in pretty handy uh, on a curvy field. You can keep your eye on your monitors and your toolbar in case anything breaks and you don't have to worry about driving and keeping right on track where you need to be. This does all that for you. see the curve there. The tractor will just follow that. I don't have to do anything. If you wonder why the wheel doesn't turn, it's because it's all hydraulically controlled. So there's not actually a connection to the GPS to the steering wheel. I don't really have to worry about that. 